Well, I've uh, I've totally discharged this uh, battery. Totally, totally recharged the battery. And last night I uh, put it on record and totally discharged the battery again. I'm gonna do it one more time. So it's fully charged now. So tonight I'll put it on record and let it run the battery down again. I'm hoping uh, in three times, doing it three times, will break in that battery. So the circuitry gets a maximum amount of smooth electrons. A circuitry loves to be used. You know, elect electronics, electronic boards, the circuitry loves electrons. And I figure if that battery's broke in, in at least three times, if I break it in, it will give that uh, circuit maximum power. And the result should be a clearer video. I'm sorry if I'm a little too close. I've noticed this thing has got a... I'm zoomed all the way down. So uh, I hope I ain't too close to it. So uh, this is my what second or third upload. Second upload on my, on my Kodak PlaySport here. So see if you can tell any difference at all. I've did the battery twice. Total discharge and recharge. We'll do it one more time. After that I'll just keep it full. After the third time I'll just keep it full charge all the time. But uh, I think when you break in the battery like that, break in the battery, it makes a maximum difference. I think it helps. You tell me. Am I clear or more clear?